Welcome back to another Spirit Island video. In this video, we are going to be playing some more Vengeance. This time into Precious 6, doing a rematch. We have Board B with a Mountain Jungle starting. Another great explore for us. Wow, incredible. Let's let's start off with the G3 here. Getting that power, power card. And we'll be placing our presence for a bottom track. And these are some amazing hits. So, I mean, these are just... I could really go with any of these options. I mean, Cold Isolation, Fast Disruption. I have Sap, which is an amazing Defend 5. Enticing Splendor is another Disruption. And then Tormenting Rot Flies. It's on element, adds disease. So really, we can go with any of these cards. Um, I'm just going to go with Sap. This is my second nature card. Just thinking here. So I... I guess I could do Fetid Breath plus Fiery Vengeance. Vengeance cleans out this. Fetid Breath adds a disease to some land. Let's go with Sap here. Presence from bottom track. We're going to defend five over here. Let's go there. And what does next turn look like? Next turn, I'll have... Animal, animal, fire. I think I take the blight here on B2. We defend five here. Take the blight on B7. Okay, I think this is good. We save strike low for later. We fiery vengeance. Killing that, and I think we're good. Hopefully, I did this will allow the build, generating that fear. Wetlands is the follow-up. We're going to pressure escalate into our beast land. All right, so I think... This is where I can use my Fetid Breath. I'm using Plague Bearers next turn. I'm going to push that disease over here into B1. So maybe I go here. And I G2. We go... Presence. Oh, no, not there. We have presence, presence, play these cards. Then I have the skip for my, my B6. I'll have a second disease here with a blight. I think that looks pretty good. We have a disease damage. I think I just do it here. Play around um, like Grim Toll or something. We have Plague Bears for this land. Yeah, it seems this is pretty good. What do we get? Years of Little Rain. Uh, this is why we escalated here into my B5. I mean, we're definitely just going to pay for this, right? Uh, let's... Wow, I have water, water. I have a wa I have another water over here. Let's forget Fetid, though. Let's proliferate. Uh -oh. Guess there, beast attack. Goodbye, beasts. Don defend. Fear card. Oh, I lost the beast. No. <laughs> I actually would have been able to... Um... Oh, that's such a shame. Coastal follow-up. Okay. Well, we have Plague Bearers here. This is working out very nicely. We could push, push with the disease. So now I can skip my beast. It might be one. Um, I'll have a defend five lined up on B3. Yeah, this looks pretty good. I think I just G2 here. Presence. Presence. Play my one card. Let's see what we got here. Um, adding it to Han, okay. Hoping for not Sands. That's a really good hit, because I can remove that Explorer, and now I'm okay with the Sands follow-up. I have to add that. We'll allow the build jungle with an escalation very sad that invested adding that town over here to b8 makes me want to cry here okay so now we are back we have the skip here we're going to defend five here in my sands that covers these lands i think i'm just going to enter a minor reclaim loop I think it was Sunset Fire. 
And I say that because I'm going to get both tiers of my innates here. And I want to have my defend five lined up over here. So I have that, have that skip. And then I have the disease damage, and that's going to be a ton. One, two, three, four, that'll be five damage here on the mountain. And then I have plague bears to move this disease around or move one of these diseases. Yeah, let's do it here. Oh, come on, man. We just keep getting these crappy events. <laughs> Temporary truce means... Um, it means that uh, a town lives here. Like, we keep getting... We add the, the town ad over here, and then now it lived over here on the sands. Oh, okay. Well, let's see. We have to still get through a couple more. We have the innate. Killing this. Actually, I think we do the innate here. Plague bears. Push. Push. Wonder if we just do plague bears here and go push, push. Move both disease like that. We have to reclaim because we want the defend five here. And five, skip. Okay, so maybe when we Plague Bears, we go push, push. So I can generate an extra fear off B1. Reclaim, get a minor power. Ooh, Territorial Strife, hello there. Fire Animal, lots of damage. I think that means we want to take the... Hmm. It's this last city here that's going to be a problem. I guess we take the Blight, maybe? Living Energy is busted card on us too, but I think I go for the Fire Animal. Sap. I think we do this, just run this back again. We actually do this instead. Ah, uh, that's the one negative to not having... It's one, two, three, boom, boom, boom. Hmm. And I also just realized that this is also an issue. So I think... I think we do this. Defend five. Disease damage. No, no, no Plague Bears. Yeah, we're going to go Blighted next turn. So we have to skip there. Disease damage here. Fiery Vengeance here. Kill the Explorer. Defend five. We have some Fear cards. Sure. Another Beast Destroy. Crazy. Um... This, I could either kill the town or I can kill that town. This could go here. I think we allow the build there. Hmm. Allow the builds. If I allow the build there. I think we do. If the jungle sands follow up, I think I had, I just enter a reclaim loop again. We take the blight here, and now just enter the reclaim loop. It's just because we have that sap, it's just, it's too advantageous. I think we just we gotta take all fear. Sap. Um I think we do sap. Not fiery. Hmm. Let's 
crazy that single town add on B8 has made this game significantly more challenging. I've had to dedicate so many resources to solving it. If I do something like this, this... It actually solves this land. I take one, two blights. I think this is okay. Promising farmland, sure. Dahan defend. Um, I could stop the extra blight here. Sure. Blighted, sure. Remove a presence. Get rid of a town. I think we go get rid of this. It says remove when your presence is destroyed. I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to get a disease there. Not going to complain though. I think we allow the build. Build. Sands Mountain. One of these has to be a town. We go town. And Plague Bearers. I think we win here that we could go town, town. Move the disease. Territorial. Or damage. And then we have build that town as well. Yep. And we just reclaim, and we should. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, yeah, so reclaim does not matter. We get here, even though that card does help us as well. And basically, we just want to use our innate in this land, kill all of the cities. That is it. GG. What a uh, what a wild game. <laughs> I mean, we had some things that went well this game. I mean, we picked up um, had that defend five sap that has the animal just massive for hitting our innates. Um, we also had a great ex starting explorer. What was it? It was mountain jungle. So um, only one of our city lands. We then have our first event was years of little rain. That was really nice being able to pay for it. But we did have some issues with Invested as well as Temporary Truce. Invested added that town here, which then caused that land because um, it added the town right at this coastal. So it, or maybe it was here is when I added. But regardless, it added and it ended up building a city, city, city all along. And we were just never able to fully clear that land up. And we had to keep spending actions to solve it. Um, temporary Truce, I guess it only mattered here, leaving the town around, but... Game ended. Um, not sure. We went blighted, of course. Oh, it says destroy. I thought it said remove a town. So, nope. So, yeah, I guess I'm um, adding that disease here. Um, yeah, that's definitely the correct play, getting the three disease in my land six there. So, if you like this video, like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video.